definitely lose a part of your soul. You lose a part of yourself, um, and it's hard to get it back uh, when you get news like that. A local nurse who gave so much to others over the years is now fighting for his life. Steve Yacoub was diagnosed with stage 4 colon cancer in 2020. He became a nurse to help people, and tonight he tells our Stephanie Dupre, even in his time of need, he continues to do what he can for others. Steph. Raven, Steve was a nurse at Geneva General Hospital for over a decade. He was given the horrible news during the peak of the pandemic. And almost three years later, he continues to wake up and fight to uphold his family's slogan, never surrender. In April of 2020, nurse Steve Yacoub became sick. What he thought was stress from the pandemic and patient influx ended up being something he never expected. Now that I have cancer now, uh, go figure, you know, I, you know, I got a home gym, you know, work out, eat good, uh, that, you know, but it, it doesn't matter. Anybody can get it. Stage four colon cancer, but now it's traveled through the rest of his body. Six months after his diagnosis, continuing his passion as a nurse, he got a letter in the mail. They could legally, you know, let me go. They didn't want anybody working from home, you know even though I was doing some good stuff. This was not a death sentence for Steve. His family lives by the motto, never surrender. Even though Steve couldn't be a nurse, he found other ways to change lives, like starting a podcast called Cancer Hope with Coach Steve and creating a home gym with his son, Zach, to train people. He doesn't charge him anything, but just he comes over and he just gives his time. He's his coach, so. Steve's wife, Amy, says the second they met, they knew they were soulmates. At one point, doctors told them Steve needed hospice care, but that didn't seem right. She has a message to other families also battling cancer. He's here because we got second opinions, so we that's a big message we want to send to others, too. Don't be afraid to say that doesn't seem right. I mean, the hard part is, you know, you, you get knocked down, but you got to just keep just got to keep getting up and, and keep fighting. Steve and his family shuffles between three cancer centers, one in New York City, Syracuse, and right here in Rochester. For anyone wanting to donate to help cover costs, I'm going to have a link to his GoFundMe on our website at WHEC.com, as well as details to an event being held later this month for him and his family. Raven. All right, great story, Steph. Thank you.